eat with your stomach in mind and not your tongue. Yep. You know what I mean? And the education of going plant mm. is just like the education I feel with people with these vaccines or people with COVID-19 is science literacy. We don't mm. know. We just don't know the knowledge. We don't know how right. easy it is to make a plant-based cinnamon roll, right? You remember, I don't know if you remember mm. when I was in the clubhouse, I told you that. Because I was sick. Yeah. My wife last night, last week, she was like, yo, so when are you going to make those cinnamon rolls again? Right. <laughs> In 2017, I was diagnosed with lupus. Wow. And for, for those of you who don't know what lupus is, it's an autoimmune disease that attacks all of your major organs. Everyone suffers with lupus in a different way. Me personally, I was hospitalized for a month. Mm -hmm. I lost 30 pounds. I, had, I was close to kidney failure. Um, I had pleurisy, which is inflammation in the lungs. So I had that moment in my life where I didn't think I was gonna survive, you know? So I had to make a decision for me personally um, to find out how I can eat electrifying and healing foods um, to live, to feel better. So that's when I started my plant-based journey. Yeah, thank you. Back in 2018, and it really came down to my husband. Um, shout out to partners. Right, who right. who keep you accountable, right? Who are all in for you too. So I just remember, you know, us talking about my my health. And he said, you know what, if you want to go plant-based, which is essentially vegan, right. um, you know, I'm here to support you. Two years later, we we've been plant-based, right? We cut out meat, we cut out dairy, we cut out eggs. Um, and I feel amazing. Yeah. Absolutely. I feel incredible.